Hi, it's Jim Collins again. Weekly, I edit the Liturgy of the Word, or whatever the page is for the liturgy that we're using for Sunday, and I wanted to show you how to do that. So I'm going to uh, screen share a couple of things. First of all, to get the lessons for the service and the collect for the day, I go to lectionarypage.net. And once I'm there, this is the URL for that, um, lectionarypage.net. I'm using year A, and I go to the date that I need, and you'll see all of the lessons listed here on the page. It's a very simple matter of copying the collect for the day. I'm using a Mac, so I hit, um, I'm copying the collect for the day. And then I go over and I uh, go to the Wealthy Affiliate site. And you'll have to ask me to get the login for that site, but it's very easy to do. And I go to Wealthy Affiliate, then Websites, then um, Monitor Websites. And then I go, once I'm in this particular screen, I go to, and I'll do it for you, all pages here. And you'll see that all of the pages that are on that website that we use are listed here. And I go to the one I want, Liturgy of the Word. It comes up. And then I simply scroll down. All of this is going to remain the same for this Sunday. I could change anything I want to. And I scroll down. And I, this is going to be the 11th Sunday after Pentecost. So I change that. If I can type it in, I'm not very good, 11th Sunday after Pentecost. And I cut this lesson and add the lesson that I'm reading for the day. Now there's another way that you can do this, but it's much more uh, complicated. It takes special spacing. So if you're trying to edit a page in Wealthy Affiliate, the simplest thing to do is to cut and paste. So I'm going to go back again to the lectionary page. And I'm going to use the second track. So I'm going to skip the Genesis lesson. And go down here to the Isaiah lesson. And once again, I simply highlight the lesson. Oops. I simply highlight the lesson, copy it, and go back over to the Wealthy Affiliate page. I'm going down to the Old Testament reading and I'm changing this because it's a reading from Isaiah. A reading from Isaiah. And I'm going to excise the reading from 1 Kings from last week. And then go up here and simply paste in the new lesson. And there it is. This is the simplest way to make changes. Now I do this, I'll then go and do the psalm, put the new psalm in, put the reading in from, I believe it's still from Romans, but the new reading from Romans, and the new gospel. And um, anything else that I wanna change, I can simply copy and paste when I do this. Now one thing you have to be sure to do is when you make your changes, you have to hit update. If you don't hit update, then the changes are lost and everything you've done you have to do over again. So I hope this has been really helpful for you. Um, again, as I said, to get to the mywealthyaffiliate.com web hosting site, you'll just have to ask me for the uh, login and password, and you can make any changes you want to if we continue to use this particular site.